Hey everyone, Jason from Westries Marine, and I'm excited to show you our first in stock 2025 Alumacraft. This is the competitor 175X. The X just means it's the new style, and we'll show you a little bit about the differences on the inside. But as long as we're on the outside, you can see the cool new design, very simplistic, uh, nice hard line here on the graphics. Um, you can't really tell because it's not in the water, but the nose actually cuts down, which gives you a much better uh, view of the water when you're out running. The other cool thing that they added is they added a sponson on. Normally the 175 would have ended right here, but you can see they added another 16 inches of sponson on the back here, which gives you a lot more flotation when you're down on the water, when you're off of plane. It gives you another foot and a half of surface, but when you're up and running, this does not touch the water and you still have a 17 foot boat as far as operating in uh, up and plane. So let's go inside and check out the rest of the boat. Now you can see they changed the, the bow setup here. They have a big, huge area. This is a Helix 12 and they're able to flush mount that in here. So room for some really big graphs, nice area to have here. You also have a cell phone holder here. And then they also have a little secret compartment where you can mount your, uh, or you can install your foot pedal. Another really cool thing they did here in the bow now is this whole inside is all, uh, rather than carpeted down there, it's all a rotomolded uh, compartment. So your stuff is gonna stay a lot drier now. Um, you don't have those, uh, those smaller compartments that are all carpet that can get wet. These are all um, nice dry storage compartments. We were in our dealer meeting. We had a torrential rain the day of the first day before the meeting and all the compartments were nice and dry. So that was really cool. You can see here now at the dash, totally new style of dash. This is a side council model, but you can actually, this is a 12 right now. You can get another 12 mounted and still have excellent sight of, uh, of the front of the boat. And then the Garmin now is what operates all of your gauges and things like that. So all your engine functions, what used to be analog gauges are now uh, all built into that Garmin. You got nice switches here on the side and you got a nice angled foot area here for the driver itself, as well as storage down in there. Nice composite area. Your trolling motor batteries go underneath that. And then the, the new setup with those tubes like that, you can easily double up fishing rods in there and you can get a lot of fishing rods in there. Another thing I didn't show on the dash here is they got a spot to store stuff, but they also have a nice drain there. So if it does get rain up in here, that can all just drain right out. The new models are the competitor, which they've always had, which had the narrower gunnel. They also make the trophy that's got the taller square gunnel. But other than that, you have the nice little stair step area here. You got a nice little cooler off on the side. And this boat here has the standard layout which is a storage on one side and a live well on the other. They also make a module that has a 50 gallon live well all the way across. They also make a FSX layout for in here, which would then have the jump seats. So you could theoretically take your fishing boat and you could put any of those three layouts in the back here. You could either have the big live well, the smaller live well with storage, or one that has the ability to be uh, have the jump seats and a ski pole in it. So this same boat could be any of those three, depending upon what you put in the back end here. And then you can see because they added that extra 16 feet, the transom would normally have ended right here. They got this little extra storage space in the back, but also the biggest advantage of this is getting a lot more stable when you're out on the water. And we're excited to do a video to show you guys how stable this boat is on the water with this new platform on the back. Stop in today at Westry's Marine. We have this 2025 for you to check out. We also have great pricing. We just bought a couple truckloads, a bunch of truckloads actually, of 2024 products, some great prices. So why don't you stop in today, check out the 2025, and see what kind of price we can give you on the remaining 2024s. See you at Westry's Marine. Thanks.